Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, it's that time again. If you've seen the title, we are dusting off the Transmog Tuesday segment that isn't always on Tuesdays, sometimes Wednesdays, maybe Thursdays. Sometimes I just forget altogether. Um, but it's always about Transmogs. Yeah. Roll the intro. I was having a conversation the other day with Young Cuddles, and we were basically talking about that I'm going to be literally stuck playing my Death Knight, which I don't mind because I love the Blood DK, while everybody else is getting to enjoy the new Evoker. I have just no 100%. Chad, our healer, is going to be jumping to try that Evoker, trying out the healer, and I know all three of our DPS are going to be trying out the Evoker, and it's going to be great for them <laughs> during pre patch because I imagine that's when we'll get hold of it. And I'm going to be stuck in the normal tank. So we got chatting about, wouldn't it be cool if they maybe come up with some sort of blood dragon knight thing? You know, a proper looking cool badass dragon knight. And we were talking about how that would work, what skills it have, which we're not going to get into in this video. But that then got me thinking about transmogs and how it would be badass to look like this sort of dragon knight concept. So, went online, had a little load of pictures, boom, there you go, there they are on the screen, and decided that, hey, do you know what, let's dig up, dig up that corpse of Transmog Tuesday, breathe some life into it, and come up with some sort of Dragon Knight idea. Let's get into our appearance. Now... I will say, we're going to first off just break the rules. I normally don't like multiple sets of the same tier piece because they're already designed to go together. But with this transmog in mind, I just thought, do you know what? The Nighthold set could just, it's going to be perfect for this. So that's the one we're going to go for to start with. We want the head and the shoulders from that set. So let's go way through. And already you can see why we're going with this. Now, we're only going to use, as I say, the head and the shoulders. But with those two pieces, it's just... They're so... There we go. I mean, look at that. Straight off the bat, we're already looking dragon warrior -y. Right, we're going to get rid of our shield, and we're going to get rid of our sword for now. Now, cloaks will wait till later, because... We'll talk about cloaks in a minute. I don't want to jump ahead of ourselves. Let's go chest. Now, obviously, we could have the full upper body and like robes look which may be dragony but we're gonna go for chest and legs which is my preferred let's have a look well i don't mind that we're gonna we'll keep that for now tabard maybe even dragonfly we put a talent on but not right now although we won't see them it's gonna put maybe those wrists on hands now, I've got to be careful because I'm looking at this and I know there's like, there's sets in here, obviously, that's going to work with the shoulders. I need to make sure we don't pick those ones. I like those just because of the skull. Okay, that's cool. Belt. There's a giant, there's a red belt. We're going to find it that has a big face on it or like a massive mouth. Every time I see it, it makes me think of like a corn berserker from Warhammer. There it is. Is that the one I want? Yeah, we'll go with that one. Legs. I want to see how the legs from Revendra look. Because I like this flared bit. But I don't know. Also, the chest is way out. So we'll go and revisit that. Or we'll go for the boots and then we'll see whether they tie in with the legs and that pulls everything else through. No, we can do better. We can and we will do better. Okay, here's the thing. I hate this where you get big plate boots that go into normal booties. It's normally a more old school look. I prefer the newer, big, beefy plate like that. Those I like. But they're a little bit out. What else have we got color-wise? See, they're nice. And they do look badass. What else? Day two. Boots seem to be our sticking point at the minute. 
One eternity later. Okay, I need to know. Oh, no, 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 no. Those. Because it pulls our belt in. Okay, likey. Go back to the legs and let's go back to the chest. Two thousand years later. Okay. Took longer than I would have wanted, but there's a world drop here that I think actually works really well for the legs. Now we kind of need our upper body because our chest just... It's not working for us, people. I mean, that chest plate kind of goes. I like that. Okay. The back. So, the reason why I say the back's a bit... Yeah, is because... Obviously, we now have the epic edition of Dragonfly. And with that, you can get a back that actually gives you wings. Then there would be no better back to have them big old demon wings coming out of you. Or dragon wings, I should say. Perfect for us. But I'm not exactly going to turn around and say, hey, you should definitely buy Dragonflight's Epic Edition just to get those wings to complete this random track mod that probably only three people are going to see. So, instead, what I was thinking for a back would be... So, I wear this which is on my DK. But I did think there is a red and gold version which may actually work better. If you flick through the pages and still in keeping with like a Dragon Knight vibe. Very jingly jangles. So many cloaks. And there we are. That one is what I'm thinking. It's a bit more in keeping with like a Dragon vibe. Now, the be all and end all, the key to this, because we're going to have, we're going to assume, let's say it's a two-handed sword, but there's any number of different appearances we could have, like, dual wielding would look fine, axe, mace, whatever, we're going to go with swords, mm, no, and it is from another warrior, so let's not go there. I mean, it does have dragon heads in the hilt, so like that, I would say 100%. You could go, like, that's a winner. But, I just want to see if there's anything else we could possibly have. I mean, that's not bad. Again, that's kind of like dragon tooth, dragon E. I know I'm clutching there, but, or we've got something like that. Which I will say is nice, but I am... Oh, no, I like what we had. Which was just pure... Yeah, it's the dragon heads that do it. It fits the colour scheme and the dragon heads just work. Now I know we've got a lot of matching pieces there, which I don't normally like to do. But I kind of think as a badass Dragon Knight vibe, that's... That's pretty cool. That's really enough for me. Thank you for watching. I will put a description, a link down below. So you guys can see what's making up this appearance. Now we can share it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. If you've got any ideas, anything that would actually work better, feel free. If you create this yourself, you can click this link. You can actually copy it to clipboard. And you are more than welcome. Put that down in the comments because I love looking at transmogs. But yeah, that's it from me. Thank you for watching. Stay safe, everyone. I'll catch you all in the next video. Ladies, everyone.